name is Jason Luke. I'm the admissions coordinator for the men's home here at Fort Lynch Anatomy. I just wanted to share with you a little bit of what brought me here. About a year ago, I came through the home and I was struggling. I was a mess. Uh, I was struggling with alcohol addiction. I was struggling with bitterness, anger, and many other things, many other works of the flesh. And I didn't realize that I had a problem until right before I came in here. I just thought that I was able to cope and, and manage my life because at the age of 20, I was diagnosed with an anxiety disorder, having panic attacks. And, um, and I never understood how I could um, mitigate that and help that. And so what I ended up doing was self-medicating through alcohol. And doing that made my life just do a downward spiral and, and uh, I was not able to function. Um, it really just robbed me of any kind of quality of life. I, I knew the Lord from a young age. My father was a minister. Um, he actually ran a, uh, a men's home, a women's home, um, a church, and two thrift stores, and as well as a um, six-month Christ-based addictions program. But see, I, what I was missing was that um, dynamic love relationship with Jesus Christ. Before I had that relationship, I had no clue. I, I didn't know how to live. And then through learning through learning how to have that relationship with Christ, it really empowered me to be able to live the abundant life instead of the redundant life. And the Lord began to bless my obedience when I came here. I didn't, it wasn't until about three months in where the Lord really began to work on my heart. And a lot of that is from my own doing. I was very belligerent. I was very selfish, self-centered. And my disciplinary record here at the home proved that. However, the Lord transformed me. He gave me a new life, a new birth. The Word tells us that we are new creatures in Christ. And that is so true. So as soon as I began to obey the Lord and submit to the will of God, my life began to radically change. My spirit changed. My countenance changed. My attitude changed. I began to be a servant of God. I began to want to help people, have compassion, empathy for others. And now the Lord uses that for His kingdom. I get to play a small part in a huge kingdom of God. And I'm just, I'm in awe by the love of God and the mercies of God. So I, I choose to um, to serve God now. Um, I'm able to help pull people out of the miry clay that I was pulled from. Um, I went from being helped to helping. And I can't praise God enough. I, I can't serve Him enough. It's not a program that is going to save somebody. It is that personal relationship with Christ. And I've witnessed it transform lives, um, bring families back together, custody, custody of children. I mean, you wouldn't believe the transformations I see. And not only does that, does that uh, do I get to witness other people's faith grow, but it grows my faith just to be a part of it. So I praise God every day that I'm able to serve.